the funniest, and something else. I can't remember what the other one is. It is six max, right? Pretty sure it looks like it's six max. Okay, here we go. All right, the code is LGRF if you want to join in and uh, vote for your favorites and all that kind of shit. Be my guest. Swedish Madness with 12 months. That's two stripes on the shield. Thank you, Swedish Madness. Is that a, uh, no, this is a, it's a E-Leaf, E-Leaf battery and a Kang, or yeah, Kanger Tech tank. All right, here we go. Everybody get ready. Listen up. Here we go. The rules will be very clear if you listen to the guy explaining them. It's pretty easy. The rules are pretty easy. Oh, and uh, one other thing. One other thing. If you um, if you can't think of something, pick a house answer. The house answers are actually really good. And you want to avoid when you actually do select uh, at the end of the round, when you select which one you think is best, Try to avoid the house answers because they give you a negative score. All right, here we go. We've set up the jokes. Now, all that's left is you. Get ready. It's time to use your words. The glory of the silver screen. In the dumper or in the garbage, it's sub the title. You're about to see a subtitled film clip that's missing a subtitle and the subtitle will be filled in by you get ready the clip will play twice now for our feature presentation а тепло ты девица тепло батюшка морозушка тепло Oh, God. Oh, good God. Are you warm, girly? Oh shit! Wow, everybody was super quick! Are you warm, girly? Not enough, old man, not enough. Are you warm, girly? I already told you, Dad, a jacket will ruin my aesthetic. Are you warm, girly? Not as warm as Grandma will make me later. Are you warm, girly? Not really, Santa, but I'm still not going inside your house. Are you warm, girly? No, I'm freezing my fucking tits off. Are you warm, girly? Who the fuck are you and where are your pants? Are you warm, girly? I just got very warm. Thank you. You may have noticed an extra answer in there. We okay. can always throw in one of our own house answers. Okay. When you press the house decoy button, you get to use one of the house answers for yourself. But watch out. Voting for any house answer will mm. deduct points from your score. So pick your favorite answer, but watch out for house answers. All right, you got you got lots of time to pick too. This game gives you quite a bit of time. God damn it! All right, fuck. This is gonna be a house answer. I know it. I know it! So you voted. Fuck! You warm, girly? Who the fuck are you and where are your pants?
Nice. Nice, Mgeggy. Are you warm, girly? I just got very warm. Thank you. I picked this one. House answer, I bet. I bet. Oh, it was Chiefs. Good one, Chief. Are you warm, girly? No, I'm freezing my fucking tits off. That's me. Come on, points. Two. Two points. Two points. Come on, two of them. One. Damn it. Not really, Santa, but I'm still not going inside your house. Ooh, I'm afraid that. Oh! And Schmageggy, and Alone Chief, and who can? Oh! God, fuck! Get fucked, y'all! Get fucked! I'll stay in first. I'll stay in first. See? That's a house answer. Good, right? Let's play. Extra, extra. Good house answers, yeah. It's fucking great. All right, write a headline for this photo. Remember, a headline, like a newspaper headline. It up. Oh Here's God! What you wrote. All right. Hey, Milne psychoanalyzes local bear for insight into his next book. Online dating often misleading. Study finds. Where's the fucking honey, motherfucker? Staring contests end with mauling. Man marries Bear, tells Paper she's still a better lay than his ex after Bear rips off Man's penis. A look back at the first build a Bear build a Bear shop. Bear interviews great male prostitute. Now, vote for your favorite answer, but watch out for house answers. I I, I think I know which one's Schmageggies. Um Fuck. This is a good one. It's a good one. If it's a house answer, it's a good house answer. Fuck. Oh, hey, I'll take one. Woo! I'll take one for mine. House answer. Oh, build a bear at my prime. Get fucked. Ends with mauling. Nice one alone, chief. I gave you that one. That was mine. Ooh, or that, that was... was a house decoy. Oh! Oh, are you gonna get fucked again, Schmageggy? Oh, oh, fuck! Oh, fucked! Oh, fucked! Woo! <laughs> Keep picking them house answers. And now for the latest in obsolete technology, <clears throat> it's blank o -matic. All right, fill in the blank. Captain Kirk found out the hard way. Don't go anywhere near the planet blank. Captain Kirk found out the hard way. Don't go anywhere near the planet blank.
there's there's actually a bunch of rounds left. Don't worry, you can come back. Trust me. There is comeback. There's definitely comeback. That is a thing that can happen. Uh, but we need, uh, who is it? Oh, Shmgeggy, okay. Okay, let's see what you weirdos wrote. Kirk found out the hard way. Don't go into your planet, Sexy Green Badger 3. It's exactly what you think it is, and it's not as good as you think it is. Don't go anywhere near the planet Hitler. Don't go any anywhere near the planet Omicron Percy I-8. Don't go anywhere near the planet directed by w William Shatner. Don't go anywhere near the planet Peg. Don't go anywhere near the planet Taxes. Don't go anywhere near the planet where all men are dead. Alright. Um Fucking That was fucking it's too good. It's gonna be a house answer. I've tr I thought I've guessed the house house answer two times in a row. But I'm sure it's the house answer again. Alright. Omicron Percy I eight. Alright. Where all men are dead? That was pretty good. I like that one. Don't go anywhere near the planet. Sexy Green Badger 3! One! Oh, okay, I'll take one. I'll take one. I'm good. Planet, don't go anywhere near the planet Hitler. Oh, planet Hitler was a house answer? Shmagegi? No, okay. Near the planet. Directed by William Shatner. I'm afraid that was the house answer. Fuck! I knew it! God damn it! Shit. I knew that was house. This is a good one, though. Good house answer. I will f actually the fuck my own ass. <laughs> is yours to ruin. It's sub, sub the, the title. title. I'm on the board. Shit. That was great. Okay. Here it is. Sub Subtitle. Okay. Throws a scroll and he talks to her. Oh my god, alright. Uh Plucker, thank you for 25 months in a row. Also, thank you to Swedish Madness for 12. Much love, you guys. Much love, much appreciated. Yeah, I did. It showed your vote, Shmagegi. It definitely did. I remember reading it. Seconds left. Wrap it up or cry it out loud. Okay, there we go. Get ready. Here's All right, what you came up with. Like Kanye said, we want prenup, we want prenup, sign it. This is a list of men that have came inside your cunt. Hey. 
I'm leaving you for Frank. Hey, all language is fine here. All language is accepted as long as it's funny. Penis. Better sign these divorce papers, you bitch. Well, actually, scroll out of one, one out of two fifty nine. Vote for your favorite answer now. Some good ones in there. Uh, thank you to Chiefs, man. Hold on, let me um, let me get you hailed properly. Oh yeah, hailed the Chiefs, man. Berserker. Thank you, Chiefs, man. I appreciate it. All right, I got to vote here. I gotta vote for the one that made me laugh. I'm sorry, it made me laugh. It shouldn't have, but it did. Fuck it. Better sign these divorce papers, you bitch. I'm leaving you for Frank. Come on, Adam, are you gonna get on the board this time? Well, actually, scroll one out of 259. Nice, Atma! So the cunt one got two at least! It's a list of metal game inside your cunt. <laughs> oh my god, Slave! Slave, you dirty! You're dirty, Slave! Did you pop ahead of me? No, I'm still in the lead! But barely, barely. Right here and right now, it's extra, extra. All right, newspapers, headlines. in paradise what up floss and dreams eight months in a row giggity to you giggity indeed here's what you wrote man wanted to get lit replaced hands for light bulbs radioactive mutation shines light on genetics Man replaces hands with light bulbs. World couldn't give a shit. Look at this fucking asshole. Thomas Edison unveils new idea for portable light bulbs. Man didn't have such a bright idea. Read all about it. Thomas Edison manages to create another fucking useless reason for a light bulb. Time to vote for your favorite. Pick a winner. All right. Hmm. 
Oh god, this is a tough one. Uh, let's see. <clears throat> oh god, all right. All right. Ugh. Let's see how you voted, shall we? Yeah, that was gonna be. Uh, I knew it was your spaghetti, but I couldn't. I couldn't give it. It's like I can't give it to the. That's too simple. Hey, oh, I got one. I'll take one. Wanted to get lit. That was a good one. Who can I voted for? Wanted oh, to get dear, lit. That was a house answer. Oh, spaghetti. Oh, house answer. House answered again. Woo. How does that house answer feel there, Schmagiggles? Woo! And now, the machine that lets you blank yourself. It's blank. Blank O Matic. Uh the traditional German word for romantic evening is blank. The traditional German word for romantic evening is blank. Mizo, what up, Mizo? Nine months in a row. Seconds left. Thank you, Mizo. Here are your All right, traditional here. German word for romantic evening is Nackenbuten. Nachtfucken. Essen mein Bumbum. If you pick this, I promise it's not a fucking house answer, you fucking pricks! Guten fucking tag. Bot fucks. Guten fucking. Okay, what for your favorite answer? It's a house answer. I don't want to get. I don't want to guess it. Oh, I know it's a house answer. It has to be. I do. You're right, Goran. I do try to hide my laughter because there's some that make me fucking laugh. Oh God, I'm the last one to pick. Thirty seconds. God damn it! I gotta go with it. I it, it made me laugh. It's a house answer. It's gotta be a house answer. It's the only one that looks like a house answer. I picked knocking Bootin. It's a fucking house answer. I know. Uh, 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 
Keeps still keeps me in the lead though. I can't believe no one pit picked uh <laughs> Botfuchs. <laughs> Get ready for our grand finale, <laughs> the lightning round we call Survey Says. In Survey Says, all point values are done. All right, I'm in the you lead, but not by much. Pumps in a row, and since Let's Play mode is turned on, you'll get 90 seconds apiece to answer each one. Here's your first prompt. All right, if your nipples had names, what would they be? Fifteen seconds left. Tick tock. <coughs> Here's your second prompt. Name something you'd keep from your doctor. Here's your third and final prompt. Make it All a right. good one. Make up a dirty Dr. Seuss book title. A dirty Dr. Seuss book title. And this, um, I, there are so many easy ones. If I see, oh, I don't want to say it because I know at least two or three people will use this book title and just switch out a rhyming word and I know it. Fifteen seconds left. Get ready. Here's what you came up with. Okay, here we go. Survey says this is... If your nipples had names, what would they be? Pepperoni Caprice and Cherry Tomato. Lefty and righty, Steve. Happy and mopey. Tweety and scrappy. Harry, curly, and big Dave. Dwayne Johnson. None of your business. Vote for your favorite answer.
15 seconds. I don't know. I don't know. Left. Survey says, name something you'd keep from your doctor. My herpes sores. Something you keep from your doctor. My life. The names I give my nipples. The fact that I vape, because he'll just make fun of me. My crippling fear of doctors. My affair with his wife and daughter. I haven't stuffed something in my butt. For your favorite answer now. Something you keep from your doctor. All right. And here's what you came up with. <laughs> All right, survey says, make up a dirty Dr. Seuss book title. Oh, the corners you'll hoe. Green pills and go ham. Pee pee goes to your ants. Green, green eggs and this dick. The Cat in the Hat, a triple X porn parody. Cox in Socks. Horton hires a hoe. Time to vote for your favorite. <laughs> Why is that even in there? Why is that even in there? I don't know. It fucking got me though. That's not even a Dr. Seuss book title. Is it? Is that a parody of a Dr. Seuss book title? Here's how you voted. All right. Nipples names. House answer. None of your business. Oh, Schmageggy with the house guess. Woo. Tweety and Scrappy. I voted for that one. This guy was like, how can a nipple be Scrappy? Come on. Yeah, Harry Curly and Big Dave. Let's go. Keep them coming. Oh, I'll take two. I'll take two. I'm good with two. All right, something you keep from your doctor. was a house decoy. Crippling fear of doc- Oh, Shikegi again. My life. Oh, the fact dear. that I vape. Oh. House answer. Did I guess that one? I think I did. No, I didn't. What did I guess? Oh, the names I give my nipples. That was pretty good. And just like that, you're back in it. Decoy. Horton hires a hoe. That was a good decoy. Oh, sorry. I'm afraid that was a house answer. Who guessed that one? Come on. PP -pee goes to Uranus. Damn it. No. No. What the fuck? No one guessed green eggs and go ham or green pills and go ham? God damn it! The final score has been tabulated. See? And the winner is that la the last game. You. The last game, who can? Nice work, who can? The spectators have named the funniest. Fuck! Player. You received the golden Hey! Joker I got the golden joker! The spectators have also named the, the dirty bird, Schmageggy. You received the Oh, dirty ho, 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 bird that's trophy. two! You Dirty bird, you. Can I make it the triple crown? The spectators have also named the most offensive. Oh, player. the most offensive. You slay. Free speech ribbon. You get it for the cunt thing, yeah. You get it for the cunt thing. Nice work. And thanks for playing. Use your words. Yeah. Y'all come back now. Here. One good answer. No, it's one good answer does not equal win. One good answer among perceived shitty answers, then yes. But that good answer could have easily been, been, uh, like, competitive with another answer. It just wasn't to the people watching. And also, I fucking laughed out loud at it. 
when I, I couldn't I couldn't read it with a straight face. All right. So who can you get to play again since you won? If you win, you get to go on to the next round if you want to. Um. Whoops! 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 whoops, whoops. God damn it! I hit play again. No, a new game. New game. New game. Stop. Uh, won't let me stop. There we go. Uh, end the game. There we go. Okay. So we're going to play again. If you want to play again, who can? You can because you won. Now we're going to open it up. Open it up to everybody. Anybody can play. I'll never get to play because I'm not a sub. Assuming. See what assuming does, Kasten? Kasten Essen, you assume that I'm not playing with non-subs. Now I'm not gonna. Now I'm not gonna play with everybody. You just convinced me that everybody should assume that I'm not opening it up to everybody. <laughs> it isn't rocket science. All right. I'm a player joining. All right, who can? We're gonna get you the room code and then we'll open it up. Let's see, who can? There you go. Okay, who can? As soon as you're in. Whoops, hold on. Okay, there we go. All right, as soon as who can's in, I will put the room code in the chat. Now, go to wordsgame.lol. It's wordsgame.lol. W-O-R-D-S, words, plural, wordsgame.lol. And then you will enter this code. I'm going to put in the chat here with the last letter replaced by a question mark. What up, Papa Drop? How you doing? The last letter will be replaced by a question mark. You have to guess, guess, guess. You have to guess that last letter correctly. We're just waiting for who can to get in. If you're, if you're doing it, you want to play again. Okay, who can? Just waiting for you. There we go. All right, so we're going to give you three letters. Last letter is a question mark. Guess the right letter you're in. Here we go. All right, if you guess the correct letter for the question mark, you will be in to win. I'll have to play Pathfinder and moderate the Pathfinder channel. It's streamed on. Love you, Zeke. I fucking died at the pee pee in Uranus. Thank you, Slaith. Good to see you. Fire Dog is in. Slip Crit is in. We got Fire Dog and Slip Crit. Phenom is in. And Lice Ham is in. All right, we've got our six. Remember, if you win, you get to play again. You go on to the next round. If I win, no one gets to go on. Except me, of course. All right, so here we go. Pay attention to the screen. We're gonna get the we're gonna get the game started. Oh, also make sure that when you enter this, and I think probably everybody's good, but make sure that when you enter, you entered your Twitch, um, your Twitch screen name. Because if you enter, if you don't enter your Twitch screen name and something goes wrong, I can't invite you back to the game and be certain that it's you. So I think everybody put their screen name in. It's good, but just be aware of that for the future. Put your screen name as your name. Okay, here we go. Put on your comedy thinking caps. Garish and floppy though they may be, it's time to use your words. Prepare no, it's all right, Phenom. Don't worry about it. Lice Ham, you're good. No, I'm just saying in case of fuck-ups. In case the game goes crash or whatever. You're about to see a subtitled film clip that's missing a subtitle. And the subtitle will be filled in by you. All right. Good luck, everybody. The clip will play I'm going to get first this time. Now, for our feature presentation. Now that we're all here, let's go over the plan again. Alright. Fill in the subtitle.
bam 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 tit 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 I got tits squeezy tits my stress ball tits bam bam <laughs> All right, one left. Looks like it's uh, who is the last one left? Oh, there we go. Okay. Here's what you wrote. Here we go. Now we're gonna go. Well, here, let's go over the plan again. This is the church. Here is the steeple. Open the doors. Watch out for the people. The target is in the dormitories, specifically the third drawer from the top of the left dresser. We put a black hole inside their base. Oops. We're gonna sneak in, in the McDonald's dresses giant cocks and start singing the Macarena. Wait until the, she is this dilated. First, hold your hands in a heart shape like this. The butthole is about this size. You may have noticed an extra answer in there. We always throw in one of our own house answers. When you press the house decoy button, you get to use one of the house answers for yourself. But watch out. Voting for any house answer will deduct points from your score. So pick your favorite answer, but watch out for house, house answers. answers. Bam, bam, bam. Mm -hmm. Bam, bam. Hmm. Oh, we got a new sub. We got a brand new sub. Hail Gorilla Zo Gaming Per Seeker. Oh shit, here we go. Go over the plan again. Wait until she is this dilated. I thought that was funny. Nice work, Phenom. I thought that was funny. Go over the plan again. The butthole is about this size. Go over the plan again. This is the church. Here's the steeple. Open the doors. Watch out for the people. That's mine. Two! I'll take two! I'll take two, baby! I'll take two! Sneaking into the McDonald's dresses giant cocks and start singing the Macarena. Not bad, Slip Crit. Alright. Nobody guessed the house answer that time. I guess Shmagegi's not in this game. From around the world and right through your window pane. We need Shmagegi here to guess the house answers so we know which ones they are. Anybody got a broom? Alright, headlines!
30 seconds. Press enter, press house answer. Uh oh, you might just get an automatic house answer. Okay, good. Okay. You're still in. You're Let's in. Let's see what you weirdos wrote. All right. Clown gets thrown out of a party after making a penis balloon. Local clown has eye poked out. Suspect little girl responds, That bitch wasn't funny. It is actually pretty lame. Little girl found dead after upsetting clown due to nose fondling. Kidnapping ring disguises itself as children's party company. Child scarred for life at her own birthday party. Bumbo the clown finally harshed, uh, finally hushed. Children rejoice. Now, vote for your favorite answer, but watch out for house answers. Damn. All right. <laughs> do, 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 do. <clears throat> I love you fucking how you Monday go. morning quarterbacks are like, that was weak. Little girl found ever said it. Nose filing. I voted for nose filing. Good one, slip crit. Oh, come on, give me two, give me three, give me four. Oh, I'll take three, baby. Oh man, slip crit. And now for the latest in obsolete tech. I hate having an early lead. That means I'm just gonna get fucked on the last round. All right, fill in the blank. Never gonna give you up. Never gonna let you down. Never gonna blank. Never gonna give you up. Never gonna let you down. Never gonna blank. Without stretching you. <laughs> Never gonna let Song Scott sing this again. You know who did actually a pretty good job singing this? Man vs. Game. He does a pretty decent job singing this song. Seconds left, so wrap it up. By the way, if you hear that bell and you're at home, that means you got about 15 Get seconds. Ready. Here's what you came up with. Alright. Never gonna give you up, never gonna let you down, never gonna use a clown to hurt you. Never gonna use real food as a dildo again. 
never gonna have much of a career beyond this song. Never gonna turn you around and invade you. Never gonna tell a lie. Never gonna cream your pie. Never gonna touch your thighs and embrace you. Never gonna stop banging your sister either. Never gonna turn you around and spank you unless you ask real nice. Never gonna make any money and marry you. Vote for your favorite answer now. Uh, by the way, you can uh, vote. If you want to jump in this room, you can vote on certain things. The dirtiest, the funniest, so on and so forth. house answer but it made me laugh it made me giggle let's see all right never gonna give you up never gonna let you down never gonna turn you around and spank you unless you ask real nice never gonna stop banging your sister either never gonna use a clown to hurt you I thought that was pretty funny Never gonna have much of a career beyond this song. House answer. Oh, house answer. Uh oh. Come on. Use real food as a dildo? Come on, nobody? Nobody? Oh, I thought that was a great one. I thought that I thought it was hilarious. Never gonna use real food as a dildo. The glory of the silver screen. I thought it was funny. Dumper, I was wrong. Put in the garbage. It's sub the title. What is it? starts after the first person writes an answer which I think is a great mechanic you've only got 30 seconds left so all right wrap it up. you got about 15 seconds if you heard that bell but don't worry the house answers are pretty good so if you can't think of one click the house answer no shit it's not a bad uh, backup And if you can't think of one, I think a house answer is provided Here's for you. what you wrote. What is it? See, I told you you could bird watch at night. What is it? I can see Andromeda. Wow, the people's faces are fucking bizarre. What is it? Check out the jolly green giant's balls. So that's why he goes ho, ho, ho. What is it? <laughs> Venus is entering Uranus. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> it's a giant <laughs> butt. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> it's a telescope, <laughs> dumbass. <laughs> what 
What is it? A giant corn in space! Okay, God damn it. for your favorite answer. <laughs> that was a reference from earlier in the broadcast. Alright, one actually, like, I gotta go with the one that I thought I had to really contain it. I had to really contain it. It might be a house answer. I, I'm, I'm, I'm guessing it's probably a house answer, but it... I don't know. Okay, so my score is 5,000. Slipcrit has 5,750, so he's winning. Or Slipcrit's winning. What is it? A giant corn in space! Who can gets a point. Points go to who can. What is it? Check out the giant you can balls. So that's why he goes ho ho ho. That's mine. Two. Nope, just one. I'll take one for that. What is it? See, I told you you could bird watch at night. Ooh, I'm afraid that was our house and. Oh! Does that mean the telescope, dumbass? That's one I picked. It's a telescope, dumbass. Whose was that? I picked that one. Oh, lice! Lice! That's three! Nice work, Lyceham. Not bad. Not bad. Dateline, right here and right now. It's extra, extra. All right, write a headline for this photo. Oh my God. A headline, remember it's a headline, not a fill in the blank or a, or a subtitle, a headline. You've got 30 seconds left. Tap it up or buy it out loud. Local drug dealer busted for being too precious. I like that one, Flickstro. That was good. Okay, here we go. Here are Everybody's your answers. In. Headline! Local baby is found at club. Baby was said to be calling the fashion police because a bitch's outfit was ratchet. Normal-sized man transfigured into toddler at local dance party. Breaking news! Two-year-old way cooler than you. Five-year-old kid found it drunk at a, at a party. He was calling for more hoes. My two-year-old made this collage by himself. Retarded child trampled at a rave. MTV Cribs returns is far too literal. Vote for your favorite answer now.
Long time lurker, keep up the good work, man. Okay, now back to lurking. Thank you, Camaro89. Thank you very much. Shit. Oh, man. Oh, there's two house answers in there. I know it. God. I hate myself. I hate myself oh, for laughing. Alright, I hate myself. I fucking voted for that. I hate myself. He's calling for more hoes. House and it's gotta be a house answer. Yeah, it's gotta be house. Alright. Someone pick mine. Yes! Bitch's outfit was ratchet! Woo! Fashion police. Alright. We got a new sub. Hail and show 615. Perseger. And show. Thank you so much for the sub. I appreciate it. All right. Fill in the blank. Go forth, Link, and retrieve that ancient relic. Blank. Go forth, Link, and retrieve that ancient relic. Blank. Another new sub. Oh, you know it. Hail, Plo Fable Man, Berserker. What is up, PLO Fable Man? Thank you very much for the sub. I do appreciate that. Welcome. Seconds left. All right. Get Go forth, Link, and retrieve that place. ancient relic, the booty of time. Retrieve that ancient relic, Bernie Sanders. Retrieve that ancient relic, the legendary Dragon's Dildo. Retrieve that ancient relic, the floppy disk. Retrieve that ancient relic, Zelda's squirrel covers. Retrieve that ancient relic, your mom. Retrieve that ancient relic, the bootylicious ass captain of the night, Tinkle. Vote for your favorite answer now. for that shit. I'm a sucker for it. There was a Zelda joke in there. Here's how you voted. All right. Thanks for relic. Zelda, Zelda squirrel covers. That's her panties, by the way, if you don't know what squirrel covers are. Your mom! 
I'm a fucking sucker for your mom. I fucking I I voted that one. That one made me laugh. Your your mom. The booty of time. And that was a house. So I was gonna say that's why I didn't vote for that one because I thought it was a house answer. Cause that that one I would. Uh, I'm afraid that was the house. Another house answer. Holy fuck. Wow. I thought Bernie Sanders was a house answer for sure, but I didn't. I didn't know Get if floppy ready disk for was. Our grand finale, the lightning round we call survey. Sex. Well, you've seen it before. You can everything in can turn around sex, on this round. Point values are Everything doubled. can turn around. You'll be shown three prompts in a row, and since Let's Play mode is turned on, you'll get 90 seconds apiece to answer each one. Here's your first prompt. Here we go. Name a song title. Let's try it again. Name a song title that describes your love life. A song title that describes your love life. Seconds left. I'm not looking at chat. I don't want to get any ideas from chat. That's why my eyes are averted. Fuck. All right. God. Here's your second prompt. All right. Make up a bad idea for a Ben and Jerry's ice cream flavor. Ben and Jerry's ice cream flavor. Bad idea for Ben and Jerry's ice cream flavor. Seconds left. Bitty bitty boo, bitty bitty boo, bitty bitty boo. There's the man. Final the ball. man versus game. Make it a good one, will you? All right. Make up a little or make up a title for an adults only Pixar film. Uh. I'm immediately disqualifying anybody who says sex toy story. I'm just saying, that's the easiest joke in the world. Sex toy story, don't do it. Don't do it. If you put that in there, erase it now. Don't do it. Too easy. Fifteen seconds left. Tick tock. <laughs> Hurry up! Oh! Okay, there's gonna be a lot of house answers on that last one. All right, survey says. Here we go. 
Name a song title that describes your love life. In the end. Song title that describes your love life. One is the loneliest number. Bad. All by myself. Walking on the sun. Living on a prayer. Like a stone. Time to vote for your favorite. Pick a winner. This is a house answer, isn't it? It's gotta be. God, it's gotta be a house answer. Fuck! Fuck! And here's what you came up with. Alright. I picked bad. It's a fucking house answer. Oh, shit. Whoops. Not yet. Cum stains and ass cheese. Ben and Jerry ice cream flavor. The worst. Cum stains and ass cheese. Semen and seed. Nothing but salt! Twitch streamer seat cushion. Cum cream with poop chocolate. Pistachio, who asked for this? Thermal paste and RGB chunks. Okay, vote for your favorite answer. Hmm. Come on! Come on! Here's Ugh. what you wrote. All right. Make up a title for an adults or, or uh, adults only Pixar movie. Wreck my junk, Ralph. Adults only Pixar film. Fuck boy story. Grinding Dory. Cars 4, Trunk Sex. Scatatui. Up and in. Ball E. Vote for your favorite answer. <laughs> I had to hold in a couple of laughs, man. I'm not kidding. I had to hold in a few laughs on that one. Trying to be diplomatic about this and not laugh at the funny answers, but goddamn, there are some funny ones for sure. <laughs> Let's see how you voted. <laughs> All right. Song title that describes your love life. Walking on the sun. Like a stone. In the end. Bad, okay, it wasn't a house answer. I thought for sure it was a house answer. Holy shit, Lysam, you jumped up into the lead. Bad. Come cream with poop chocolate. I voted for that one. That one made me laugh. Oh dear, that was a house answer. Come cream with poop chocolate. Just it's so descriptive and, and very poorly written. Twitch streamer seed cushion! Three! Woo! That's me, baby. All right. Cars for trunk sex. Pixar sex uh, ball E! I'll take one for ball E. That was a house decoy. Oh, come on! Fuck boy story! Was a decoy? So they do swear. Oh, sorry. House answer. Wow. Fuck boy story. They do swear. Another cunning use of a house decoy. Oh my god! What a great fucking house decoy! Wow! 
Scatatouille was a decoy! Holy fuck! See? The house decoys are fucking good! The final score has been tabulated. Oh! The spectators have named the funniest player. Me! You me! Yeah! Me again! Golden Joker, I'm funniest. The spectators have also named the. I don't think I was the dirty bird. You received. No, the Phenom got the bird dirty bird trophy. award. You dirty bird. You, you dirty bird. The spectators have also named the most offensive player. Offensive you fire dog. Free speech ribbon. Congratulations and thanks for playing. Use your words. Nice Join work! Us next time, for more of those hilarious masters of comedy, you people! You people! What do you mean, you people? Alright. Oops. Not bad, everybody. That was fun. A lot of fun. A lot of fun. Alright, no winner except I was the winner. So we're gonna have five, count them, five new players. Alright, five new players. And, uh, oh, Section 9 Spectre with five Case months. Number one, man. Thank you, Section 9 Spectre. I appreciate it. Five months in a row for you. One more, you get your two stripes, baby. Two stripes. All right. This one is for subs. We opened it up last game. This one now is for subs. We alternate. We go subs, open, subs, open, subs, open, like that. Okay? So this is one for subs. Gold badges take precedent. Uh, let's see here. Whoops. Grab a web and Let me get in here first. A smartphone, a tablet, or anything with a browser, and navigate to www.wordsgame.lol. Then enter the room code. Join. All right. Oops. Zeke. That's me. Zeke is me. Okay. Uh, let's see. Uh, Mikkelgaard, you want in? All right. Mikkelgaard's got that gold. Oh, isn't this fun? Sending you the room code, Mikkelgaard. Uh, Miss Merck, get you in there. All right. All right, let's see who else. Um. Now we're looking for, let's see here. I sent you a code there, Miko Guard. Let's get a uh, smarty girl, let's get you in. Get you in there, smarty girl. Um, hold on, peepsy. Who else? You can, yes, you can play it in your browser, there is, you bet. we have I think we have we might have one more slots there's Mikkel guard oh we're waiting for ween is and J man okay okay so we got a full game this time be aware that subs and non subs alike can make it into the open game so next game will be open to the public and uh, all you have to do is guess a letter of the alphabet correctly, and then you can you'll be in the game. Okay? 
So we're just waiting on Ween is. Give me one second. I'll be right back. Join in in the audience. Just get that LOGX, put that in your browser there, or put that in your wordsgame.law, and you can do, you can be a, uh, a spectator and choose the funniest, all that kind of stuff. Funniest, crassest, most offensive. All right. Let's rock and roll. Papa Drop, what did you say? You look like a bum. You look like a bum. Hate fucking another bum in a porta potty. <laughs> Sounds like you've seen that before. All right, here we go. We've set up the jokes. Now, let's rock and roll. Let's Good luck, everybody. You. Good luck. Get ready. It's time to use your words. The magic of cinema is yours to ruin. It's sub the title. You are about to see a subtitled film clip that's. Oh, Stoop Kid! Subtitle. Real Dark Wolf! Will be hey, Real Dark Wolf, thank you, you for three years! Get ready. Three years, Real Get Dark Wolf, thank you! Now, and also, thank you, Stoop Kid, for eight months, you guys, I appreciate that. I may never see you again, so there's something I must tell you. I may never see you again, so there's something I must tell you. It's hard trying not to look at chat. You kind of, I want to, it's right here and I want to look at it. Um. Insert witty message here. Thirty seconds. All right, okay. Doobie Twenty Five. Thank you. Wrote. All right, here we go. I may never see you again, so there's something I must tell you. That wasn't my gun digging in your hip. It was something else. It was my gun-shaped penis. I'm not sorry. I shamed you for eating boogers, but the truth is I eat mine too. I shamed you for eating boogers, but the truth is I eat mine too. 
I'm leaving with Greta. She knows how to do that thing with her tongue. You refuse to learn. That was four sausages I put in there. You might want to get yourself checked for STDs. I have a few. The show's starting, so we better hurry the fuck up. I had a threesome with the captain and the first mate, and you'd be a hot dog in a hallway. You may have noticed an extra answer in there. We always throw in one of our own house answers. When you press the house decoy button, mm. you get to use one of the house answers for yourself. But watch out. Voting for any house answer will deduct points from your score. So pick your favorite answer. But watch out for house answers. Tough one. I'll go with that one. Yeah, I'll do that one. Here's All right. Yeah, there was Azra. Something I must tell you. The show started, so we better hurry the fuck up. I had a threesome with the captain and first mate to be a hot dog in the hallway. If if no one picks mine, you might want to get yourself checked for STDs. I have a few. Oh, I don't think anyone's gonna pick mine, are they? Fuck. That's house answer. House answer. Yeah, fuck you. I know. God damn it. Come on, gun in the hip, gun in the hip. Yes, it wasn't my gun digging your hip, it's something else. My gun shaped penis, I'm not sorry. Two! See? There's a dick joke. Dick joke. And now, for news that refuses to go beyond the headlines, it's extra, extra. All right, headline for this photo. Headline. Socks. Uh, by the way, thank you, Doobie, for 25 yeah, months. I don't want to gloss over that. You thank you. All right. Mall Santa shits pants while on the job. Lady customer notices. Underdressed matador asks Santa for pants. Naughty girl moves to the top of Santa's list. Santa baby, could you give me a new pussy for Christmas? Mine's all worn out. Santa's getting it in early this year. Woman wants to know why Rudolph's nose is really red. Thanks for giving me my present early this year. Now, vote for your favorite answer. 
but watch out for house answers. Okay, that's pretty funny. That's pretty funny. <clears throat> Let's see. Oh, uh, did I pick a house answer? Santa's getting it in early this year. J Man. Mall Santa shits pants while on the job. Lady customer notices. Santa baby getting pussy mine's all worn out. Oh dear. Oh, a house come on! I'm getting fucked on the house answers! Son of a bitch! I thought that one was clever. The, the matador asked for pants. And That's pretty clever, I thought. Good house answer. It's blank o -matic. It takes two to tango, but it takes three to blank. It takes two to tango, but it takes three to blank. Try not to look at the chat. All right, takes three, two. All right. Here's what you wrote. All right. It takes two to tango, but it takes three to properly install a light bulb into someone's ass. But it takes three to human centipede. But it takes three to double penetrate. But it takes three to human centipede. <laughs> but it takes three to worship the devil. But it takes three to menage a trois. Menage a trois. But it takes three to give your mom a good time. Vote for your favorite answer now. Hmm. Uh, Resic Zero was 17 months. A little bit of lurker love. Thank you so much for the lurker love. I do appreciate that, Resic. Welcome back. Yeah, what I don't understand is how, how they would decide which one is which. Like, who gets the points? Because human centipede was my answer. I wrote down human centipede. And no one's going to pick it, are they? No. No one's going to pick it. How the fuck did I do that? Did someone else write Human Centipede? Because I wrote Human Centipede. That was my answer. Ah, the glory of the silver screen. Uh, let's throw it in the garbage, shall we? It's no, that double answer fiddle. fucked me. I think it fucked me out of a, at least one point thing. Come meet at the gate, Ivan. I have a new dress and... Come meet me at the gate, I even have a new dress, and...
Oh, you actually knows what she's saying, Azra or Arza? That's awesome. Here All right. are your answers. Come meet me at the gate, Ivan. I have a new dress and there's nothing underneath. I have a new dress and I took my dick really good this time. I have a new dress and I had way too much coke this morning. I have a new dress and I have the fanciest cock ring you've ever seen. I have a new dress and a freshly shaven pussy. I have a new dress and I want you to try it on dance with me. I have a new dress and I'm ready for you to rip it off and toss it on the floor. Time to vote for your favorite. Tough choice, tough choice. You've only got 30 seconds. I know, shut up! So wrap it up. God damn it. I know I picked the house oh, answer! No, Fuck! Did. I know I did! I have a new dress and a freshly shaven pussy. I have a new dress and I took my dick really good this time. Come on, give it to me. One, two, fuck, only one. Come on. I have a new dress and I want you to try it on and dance with me. Oh, that wasn't a house answer. Well, that sucks. All right. I the fanciest cock ring you've ever seen. Couple from Eagle Guard. All right, how we doing? How the score's looking? Smarty Girl and Miko Guard are tied for first with five. The power of journalism is in your hands, but be careful, it's sticky. Let's play Extra Extra. All right, headline for this. Headline, headline, headline. Bip, 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 bip,
<laughs> Megatron's dick found in Dean and Marty's house. <laughs> All right, here we go. Get ready. Here's what you came up with. Lesbian refuses man's penis. Woman divorces man after striking all. Man heard her comment. Fucking typical. Mud bombs fun, but infective, says Defense Department. Couple installs new septic tank after their, theirs explodes, covering them in shit. Harry Mancave and Deatra Bush try out new industrial-sized dildo. Architects discover medieval cock armor. Couple build first successful shit steamer. Vote for your favorite answer now. one here's how you voted first couple a uh, couple build first successful shit steamer woman divorces man after striking oil man heard to comment fucking typical that's mine architects discover medieval cock armor I voted for that one industrial sized dildo all right Ooh. God damn you, Mikkelgard. Jumping up! And now, the machine that lets you blank yourself. Oh, architects. Like I didn't even make that correlation that architects don't discover anything. Whoops. Uh, if you think Benedict Cumberbatch has a strange name, wait till you meet his cousin, blank. If you think Benedict Cumberbatch has a strange name, wait till you meet his cousin, blank. Cousin Penelope, Penelope Cumminer Snatch. Wait till you meet his cousin, Engelbert Humperdink. Wait till you meet his cousin, John Dick Smells Like a Corpse Fart. Wait till you meet his cousin, Philip Rassel. Wait till you meet his cousin, Cum Bubble Fussle Knob. <laughs> Wait till you meet his cousin, Frinkle Dicky Doo. Wait till you meet his cousin, Arnold Batch of Cum. Okay, vote for your favorite answer. It wasn't even close for me. It wasn't even close. God damn it. Let's see how you voted. All right. 
Villa Barassel. Smarty girl gets one. Come on. Dick smells like a corpse fart. I'll take one. I'll take one. One. One's fine. I'll take one. Come bubble fuzzle knob. It wasn't even close for me. God damn. God damn. Fuck. God, that was good. I shouldn't have. I couldn't hold my laughter. Get ready I couldn't hold my laughter. The lightning round we call Survey Says. Don't worry, Miko Guard. It can In all turn says, around. All point values are doubled. Double You'll point sure value. Remember that. One good answer puts you in contention. On, you'll get 90 seconds apiece to answer each one. Here's your first prompt. All right. Make up a bad name for a summer camp. Here's your second prompt. Name something you wouldn't want mom to find in your room. Shut up, slip crit. You shut up, you shut your mouth. Here's your third and final prompt. All right. Make it a good one. Make up the name of a disappointing supervillain. Disappointing supervillain. Rock your socks, I would be a disappointing supervillain because I'd be a superhero! You butt fuck! Butt f I was gonna say butt face and dumb fuck at the same time, and it came out butt fuck. So, let me just say that again. You butt face dumb fuck. Fifteen seconds left. Tick tock. And here's what you came All up right. with. All right. Here we go. Survey says bad name for a summer camp. Cap wanna touch a booby. Camp sticky on my back. Camp I'm all up in ya. Camp never leaving alive. Tramp stamp camp. Camp this one time at band camp. Camp apocalypse now. Vote for your favorite answer now. Mm. 
How come none of them came up with a Holocaust joke? Here's what you wrote. Probably couldn't think of a cleverer way to use it. Name something you wouldn't want mom to find in your gas. Dad's gas power dildo. You wouldn't want mom to find in your room. Dad's gas power dildo. Evidence of my Flonase addiction. David Schwimmer body pillow. Dad's body. Dad's corpse. My giant black dildo. My gangbang schedules. Vote for your favorite answer now. Bam, bam, booty, doo, doo, doo. No, it, the the two dad's body and dad's corpse cancel each other out, so that means neither of them are gonna get voted. I believe, I would imagine. Okay, let's see what you weirdos wrote. Survey says, make up the name of a disappointing supervillain. Socially awkward ladies man. Disappointing supervillain. The mansplainer. Professor premature. The diddler. Run away from danger man. Captain comes too soon. Richard Spencer. Time to vote for your favorite. Pick a winner. How you voted? Bad name for summer camp. Oh, sorry. Oh, tramp stamp camp. House answer. Oh shit! Come on, I'm all up in ya. I'm all up in ya. I'm all up in ya. Oh no! Why did it have to be yours, Mickelgard? Fuck! I voted for it. That was a house decoy. Ah, fuck! <laughs> fuck! <laughs> nice decoy. There's no way I can't catch up. Yep. Another cunning use of a house decoy. I can't catch up. There's no way. <laughs> That's not a villain. The mansplainer is a villain! God damn it! Nice work, Mickelgard. I hate losing. I hate losing! The final but good job. The score has been tabulated, and the winner is. You! The spectators have named the funniest player. You receive the Golden Joker Award. Oh, you got the funniest. You even stole that from me, you <laughs> son of a bitch. Also named the grossest player. You received the Dirty Bird. Oh, I'm Smarty you Girl's the Dirty Bird. You. The spectators have also named free the I'm not going to get anything. Player. You oh, I did. The free speech rhythm. I got most offensive. I'll take it. I'll take one. Congratulations. And nice. Nice. Use your words. 
see you next time. Nice work, everybody. Nice work. Good work, y'all. Good work. All right, we got a new sub. Oh, yeah, brand new sub. Hail, Skimpin, Berziger. <laughs> What's up, Skynthan? Skynthan? I'm not sure how to say it. Sign Skynthan? Oops. With a S-C-Y. All right. We're going to play one more game. It's going to be open to the public except for Mikkelgaard. Mikkelgard gets to play like automatically. A tablet or anything with a browser and navigate to www.wordsgame.lol. Then enter the room code. All right. And then we'll give Mikogard the code. Do you want to play again, Mikogard? I'm just guessing you do, but you won, so you get to play again. Give you the code there. Oh, is it this one? All right, and then we'll give everybody a chance to enter. And how you you go to wordsgame.lol, wordsgame.lol. And then I will give you three of the letters and one question mark. Replace that question mark with the right letter and you're in to win. All right? It's your rotating prime sub. Oh, well, thank you very much. Thank you, Scyntan. I do appreciate it. Okay, here we go. Anybody can enter. This is open to the public. Just guess the right letter for the question mark. Here we go. All right, good luck, everybody. It's easy, you'll see. final game of the night. Thank you very much for everybody for hanging out. Hopefully you stick around for the last game. Good luck. And away we go. And now, live from wherever you crazy kids are, it's time to use your words. Prepare you know the to Red be Bull. in glorious 2D. It's sub the title. You're <sighs> about to see a subtitled film clip that's Missing a subtitle, and the subtitle will be filled in by you. Get you. Ready. The clip will play. I mean twice. you. Now for our feature presentation. Here we go. I'm not interested in marrying you. Why not? What? Why not? I'm not interested in marrying you. Why?
Dark Lotus Homie! What up, homie? What up, homie? Got 17 months for Dark Lotus Homie. Thank you very much. Welcome back. Okay, here we go. Here's what you came up with. I'm interested in marrying you. But you Why not? Because I like golden showers. And you're like, what? I'm not interested in marrying you. Why not? I don't like boys. I'm not interested in marrying you. But you Why not? I can't be with a man with a better hair than me. I'm not interested in marrying you. But you Why not? Because this is a dream. I only like a man's cock is bigger than mine. Because you're a fucking pedophile. Because I'm already fucking your father. You may have noticed an extra answer in there. We always throw in one of our own house answers. When you press the house decoy button, you get to use one of the house answers for yourself. But watch out. Voting for any house answer will deduct points from your score. So pick your favorite answer. But watch out for house answers. See, it's funny to hear you guys say which ones you think are funny because, and that's that's where like people are saying like that was a weak round, because everybody says the humor is so different because like none of those really got me, like none of those really like hit me in the gut with laughter. You've only got 30 seconds left, so wrap it up. I don't know, man. It was tough. It's tough. <sighs> no, I can be entertained. Because this is a dream. I thought that was kind of clever. I can't be a man with better hair than me. Sorry, house answer. Oh, bunny, I'm sorry. I'm interested in marrying you. Why not? Because I'm already fucking your father. I only like when a man's cock is bigger than mine. Yep. Golden shower one was mine. I I told you I was into golden showers, and you were like, "What?" Dateline right here and right now. It's extra, extra. All right, headline time. Write a headline for that. Oh my god. Don't go, oh my god. Don't. It's so easy. It's so easy. Seconds left. Wrap it up or buy it out loud. 
Jesus. Weenus and Yuki are off to a big lead, here, big start. All right, here we go. Elderly wo Wonder Woman still rocking that invisible plane. Local grandmother shows off how she uses salt and pepper and where both of them end up. Tesla developing new imaginary car. 85-year-old woman first to ride invisible motorcycle in Whiteout. Elderly woman enjoys last orgasm. That was my first poop in 23 years, exclaims 84-year-old woman. Old woman pretends she's skiing. It's really pooping. Now, vote for your favorite answer, but watch out for house answers. Mm. Man, I'll just say I think the first one was the most clever. Let's see. I think the first one was the most clever, man. Tesla oh, developing new imaginary car. Who? Oh, oh, Allie. Oh, then she's getting. Is really was pooping. Answer. I thought the Wonder Woman one was really funny. Yep, rocking that invisible plane. Oh my god, that was a house answer! That was good, fuck. Salt and pepper, yes! Oh, give me one more, you fuck! God damn you, weenus! Come on, salt and pepper and where they end up! Right here, come on, that was great, fuck now, you. <laughs> for the latest in obsolete technology, it's blank o -matic. I say I'm fine, but what I really mean is blank. I say I'm fine, but what I really mean is blank. Seconds left. Dog fucking this game. <laughs> All right. Here are your answers. I say it fine, but what I really mean is you fucked up. I say I'm fine, but what I really mean is I'm not drunk. You drunk? I just puked it, so I'm good. So I'm good. I say I'm fine, but what I really mean is I'm dying inside. I say I'm fine, but what I really mean is I identify as a radish. I say I'm fine, but what I really mean is bite your bottom lip, bitch, it's going in dry. I say I'm fine, but what I really mean is leave me the fuck alone. I say I'm fine, but what I really mean is yes, I really do wish Grandpa would wear some pants for once. Okay, what were your favorite answer?
That one, one of those, it doesn't make sense. Two of those don't make sense. Three of them don't make sense. Three of them don't make sense. Here's how you voted. That makes sense. I'm dying inside. I'm not sure. That's me. Oh, one. Oh, man. Okay. You fucked up. That makes sense. What I really mean is, I identify as a radish. House answer. Doesn't make sense. Wow. The glory of the silver screen. In the dumper, or in the garbage, it's sub the title. Excited for the pre-pre-show, me too, Mr. Scott Evans. All right, here we go, subtitles. First we dug a huge pit, then... That's a tough one to get funny on. If someone can make this, make that one really funny, I'll tip my hat to you. Mm -mm -mm. There was nothing really obvious about that. If, if something comes out like super funny like makes me have to hold back laughter I'll tip my hat to you that's a tough one there's nothing like outstanding about it that that could make it like in my mind that setup is a tough one to make funny to get a punchline on ready here's what you All right. came up with first we dig a huge pit then we filled it back up it was totally pointless First, we dig a huge pit. Then, we cover it with this piece of paper. First, we dig a huge pit. Then, we put all the dirt back in it and call it a day. First, we dig a huge pit. Then, so I can store all the fucks I don't give. First we dig a huge pit, then fill the hole back up, then build something useful. First we dig a huge pit, then we set traps like in Home Alone. First we dig a huge pit, then we cover it with paper, perfect camouflage. Yeah, see, favorite. tough. It was tough. It's tough. Bam. Um, that was a th see. It's not us that aren't funny. It's the setup. Sometimes the setup is fucking rough. No, I looked at your guys' answers in the chat and none of yours were funny either. 
Trust me. It was a fucking setup was was tough. Yeah, build a sex dungeon. See, that's not super funny. Kawari Thunderclaw. It's it's all right. You voted. Just like all of our answers. It's all right. Not super duper funny. We set traps like in Home Alone. Now that was a house decoy. I'm just saying, it's the setup. It's not it's not the punchline that's not funny. The setup is tough. First we dig a huge bit. We filled it back up. It was totally pointless. That was mine. Yep. And mine wasn't super funny either. I'm just I'm trying to make a point that the setup has to has to help you out. From around the world and right through your window pane. It's extra extra. Anybody got a broom? All right. Punchline or punchline headline. Headline time. Well, here's the thing. You try, like, when you look at a, 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 a setup or something like that, you rifle through all, like, there are five setups for this, for this picture that are probably what a lot of people are thinking. Like, I'll just, I'll just let you in on the first thing that came to mind. Uh, something about Montana's space program is really taking off or something like that. Like, and I had to rifle through that one and go, eh, no, no. Someone's probably already thinking that. What's up, though, Rake? Hail, though, Rake! Berserker! Here's what Thank you, though, Rake! Alright, here we go. Which is fine, new form of travel! It's a blast! Western Witch flies through the sky on her modern broomstick! Texan wins chili cook-off, rides off in a sunset to celebrate! Jackass, the early years! Woman's last words heard to be, did you light the fuse yet? Local witch steps up her game. Crotch rocket surprisingly not in someone's pants. Vote for your favorite answer now. You wore the shirt today, right on dirty dog. See how you voted. All right. Western Witch flies through the sky in her modern broomstick. Which is fine. New form of travel. It's a blast. Cross Rocket surprisingly not in someone's pants. 
Jackass, the early years? I'm afraid that was the house answer. Really, guys? Really? Really? You, did you light the fuse? Yeah, nothing? That was mine. God damn. I thought I was gonna get at least one for that. Mothers and doctors alike. Not as funny as I thought I was, see? Not as funny as I think I am. The greatest gift of all is love. The worst is blank. Alright. The greatest gift of all is love. The worst is blank. Yep, look at that. Look at all you guys thinking you're funny and putting the same answers as everybody else. Thinking this shit is easy? Being funny ain't easy. Because you gotta be original. Sometimes you take a chance on something you think is original and funny and it falls flat on its face and it sucks. Seconds left, so wrap it up. Do 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 The worst is a handwritten gift card for sexual favor from your partner. Like you can really cash in at any time? Oh, sure. The worst is wanting to push back. The worst is a case of mono. The worst is impotence. The worst is a lifetime subscription to Zeke. Greatest gift of all is love, the worst is. Yeah, you can probably bet that that last one's not a house answer. <laughs> Here's how you the worst is impotence. Greatest gift of all is love. The worst is a handwritten gift card. Oh dear. I voted for that one. Oh, the house answer. Of course it was. Fuck. Also love. What a fucking hassle, right? Two, three. Oh, come on. Four. Woo! Woo! Yeah! Ready for our grand finale, okay. the lightning round. We now we're in it to win it. Survey says, <laughs> in survey says, all point values are doubled. You'll be shown three prompts in a row, and since Let's Play mode is turned on, you'll get 90 seconds apiece to answer each one. Here's your first prompt. Name a word or phrase that shouldn't describe a bite of cake. <laughs> Name a word or phrase that shouldn't describe a bite of cake.
15 seconds left. Hmm. Here's your second prompt. Name something you shouldn't do at the dinner table. Name something you shouldn't do at the dinner table. Here's your third and all right. Here we go. Make it a good one. Make up the name of a roller coaster you wouldn't try. Man, I just thought of three that are just like easy, easy, easy. I thought of three, and I'm gonna see him in chat. I know it. Yep, there's one. I saw that in the chat. 15 seconds left. Saw one of them. <laughs> Runavaya. Runavaya, you would get my vote with the ass wizard. The ass wizard. I love that one. Okay, here we go. Survey says, all right. A word or phrase that shouldn't describe a bite of cake. Almost totally hairless. Shouldn't describe a bite of cake. Savory. Shouldn't describe a bite of cake. This cake tastes and smells like my grandma. Shouldn't describe a bite of cake. This is drier than your pussy, grandma. Shouldn't describe a bite of cake. Hairy. Interesting. Shouldn't describe a bite of cake. Swamp ass. Shouldn't describe a bite of cake. It's really earthy. And is that corn? Vote for your favorite answer now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. KL Blug. Thank you, KL Blug. KLB Lug. 17 months in a row. Much love. Okay, much appreciated. Let's see what you weirdos wrote. Okay, here we go. Survey says, name something you shouldn't do at the dinner table. Pop the zits on your ass. Shouldn't do at the dinner table. Dry hump the turkey. Shouldn't do at the dinner table. My ex-wife, apparently. Shouldn't do at the dinner table. Fellatio. Shouldn't do at the dinner table. Rub your foot on dad's package sensually. Shouldn't do at the dinner table. Pray to name a deity. Shouldn't do at the dinner table. Think only of killing. Shouldn't do at the dinner okay, table. Oh, that's it. Okay. <laughs> One of those made me laugh. One of those definitely Here's made me laugh. Ready. Here's what you came up with. Survey says Make up the name of a roller coaster 
the rectal thermometer that you wouldn't go on, right? That you wouldn't try, right? The balsa wood bobsleigh. Roller coaster you wouldn't try. The identity confuser. Roller coaster you wouldn't try. The testicle tangler. Roller coaster you wouldn't try. Boomerang. Roller coaster you wouldn't try. The screaming cussing ball of hate and spite. Woman, whim, woman for short. Roller coaster you wouldn't try. The popsicle stick tower of fun. Roller coaster you wouldn't try. There it is. Let's see how you All right, play. here we go. Shouldn't describe a bite of cake. Swamp ass. I voted for that one. Oh, I was the only one to vote for swamp ass. Okay. Drier than your pussy, grandma. Hey! Hey! Almost totally hairless. Something you just shouldn't do Ooh, with the team. Sorry. Think only of killing. Oh, that was a house answer. Fuck. Fuck. God damn it. Think only Keep of killing. Going. Think only of killing made me laugh. <laughs> Think only of killing. <laughs> Dry hump the turkey. Oh, mine didn't even get any points on that one. Okay. House answer. The balsa wood bobsleigh. A roller coaster you wouldn't try. The testicle tangler. I voted for that one. Oh my god! Oh my god! Ellie! What the fuck? No one no one voted for the identity confuser? Not one for the identity confuser! That shit was fucking great! Fuck you! Winner is Fuck! You! The spectator. Oh, come on! The player, you received the Golden Joker Award. Son of a bitch! The spectators have also named the grossest player. You received the Dirty Bird Trophy. You wow. Dirty Bird, you. The spectators have also named the most offensive player. You received the free speech. Ribbon. You got two awards, though, Mikogar. Good job. Congratulations. All right. And thanks for playing. One first you and three seconds. Congratulations, words. Allie, on the Next win. On use your words. Congratulations on the on the, the win, Allie. Allie. Good job. The awkward silence. You pulled it out at the end. Nice work. Very, very nice. All right. That's it for me today, guys. Thank you all for coming out. I appreciate it. Good to have you here. Uh, tomorrow's Drop Frames. Tomorrow's Wednesday, and it's Drop Frames on Wednesday. Uh, I'm not sure who our guest is yet. We had a couple asks. We had a couple invites out. I'm not sure who actually we ended up with, but uh, I guess we'll find out. But that's it for me, guys. Thank you for being here. I appreciate it. Hope you guys had a good time. I know I did. But uh, that's all I got. Drop frames tomorrow. So until next time, guys. For all of my Berserkers. For all of Zeconia. This is me, Zeke, saying. Zia. <laughs> <laughs>